Hi, fourth graders, it's Miss Leon. I'm coming back to you with um, some more learning around how to start writing our draft for our opinion piece. If you remember, the opinion piece that we're writing about is COVID is the worst. That is our claim. So I'm going to go ahead and share with you my teacher copy of how COVID is the worst. So if you can see on the screen, we went and we wrote the first body paragraph. That was COVID is the worst because it is contagious. And if you remember all of the information that we wrote about supports the reason of us saying that COVID is the worst and why? Because it's contagious. This is all evidence. So we got this information from using our outline. We had created this outline with partners um, before, last week or a few lessons before, and we added these facts and these mini stories. And remember that I just copied this topic sentence, this reason I copied that and I pasted that into the document right here, and this is my topic sentence. So what I'm going to do now <clears throat> is I'm going to start writing my second body paragraph. And how I'm going to begin is I'm going to go to my outline, which is right here. And you should have this document and also your draft document, which is this one, both available to you at the same time. So I'm going to where it says body paragraph number two. I'm going to highlight this, that I think COVID is the worst because we can't go where we want to go. So I'm copying that. And I'm going to come over to this document. I'm going to highlight this whole line right here for body paragraph number two. And I'm going to paste that topic sentence in that place. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the information that I have, my facts and my mini stories from here in my outline to help me write this paragraph. Remember, Paragraphs are a minimum of four sentences, four sentences minimum. But if you are adding in your mini stories as well as your facts, you will probably have at least six sentences or more. So I have information saying that COVID is the worst because we can't go where we want to go. And right here, the first thing that I said is, I wanted to go to the zoo, but we couldn't because there were so many people there. And then it says my family plan on taking a vacation to Cancun, but due to COVID and there, there are travel restrictions, we are not able to go to Mexico. Instead of going to Mexico, we went on a road trip to Florida. And then I also had an example of the movies. It's somewhere I wanted to go, but I couldn't because of COVID. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to start adding that information into my draft. Okay, so I see this information and I'm going to come to this part. Okay, I think COVID is the worst because we can't go where we want to go. So I'm just gonna type the word in right here. I'm gonna type two things because I wanna remember, I'm gonna type in movies and then I'm gonna type in the next word, which is zoo. Not because it's a sentence, but because I wanna remember this. So I'm going to be using this document that I have about transitional words and phrases. And I'm gonna help myself write sentences using these transitional words. So I really like these right here, these illustrations and these addition words. So I'm gonna say an instance or for instance or for example, and I'm gonna add this into my document. We can't go where we want to go. Then here we go. For example, comma, I really enjoy going to the movies with my son. We have not been able to go to the movies since COVID. 
I also notice that since people are not able to go to the movies like they used to, there are not any new movies being shown. I just thought of that part right now because all I wrote was movies, but that then prompted me to think, you know what? And then I added to that idea. Now I'm going to come back here and it says do. And I'm going to use these transitional words. So another example or something like that. So example, instance, in the case of, or additionally, I could say that, or in addition, I like that, in addition. In addition to not going where we want to go, my family wanted to go to the zoo, but we couldn't, and I forget, why couldn't we? Hmm, I'm gonna look back at my outline. We couldn't, oh, because there were so many people. We couldn't because there were so many people and there has or there is a restriction on the number of people in any place, period. Now, I still have to add my mini story, but you should be able to get the idea. And I am looking at this before the mini story, before I even put the mini story in, I have one, two, three, four, five sentences before the mini story. So go ahead and use what you have and use what you know to build your second body paragraph. Use the outline and make sure that you're using transitional words to create um, complete sentences and that have a subject so we know who or what and a predicate what they are doing the who or the what and what is happening in the sentence. Good luck. I know what you have will be great.